a... I'm nervous to try it. Should I call 911? Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I am at Best Buy. I bought a vlog camera, finally, and I'm here to pick it up. I think I'm gonna go in to get it because I just wanna look and see if they have any sticky things for my car to mount it on. So I'm gonna walk inside actually to get it instead of, I ordered curbside pickup, but um, instead of them coming out to me, I'm gonna go in. Okay, so I'm back in my car. But while I was in there, I wanted to look for like a mount for my car for to vlog with my camera like in my car. But they didn't have any in there. So I just figured I'll order one on Amazon. It'd probably be so much cheaper anyway. Got my camera. Um, I'm so excited to open it. So we're gonna do a little car unboxing. The flip up screen is everything that I have always needed. So it comes with just this the camera. And then it also comes with, um, you know, the, the battery. It's a very small battery. And the charger. And then a strap, which I probably won't put on because straps are annoying. This is going to fit in my purse so easily. And that's what I'm, like, the most excited about. This was, like, a very spontaneous but not spontaneous purchase. Because I've been wanting this for a very long time. All right. I'm going to switch to this. So hopefully there will be a dressed difference in quality all right so this is amazing uh the battery's already flashing which i knew that was gonna happen because i got in charge it yet um uh, i'm so excited about this let me film this on my phone so you can see another perspective the quality is definitely so different and i'm so happy about it um it's so little so i am so excited about this i'm gonna head home because I have a class on Zoom, um, and then I have another class later tonight. Both of my classes tomorrow got canceled, and I am so excited and happy about it. So I bought these quinoa tortillas. I have no idea if I even like quinoa, so... We're gonna try and make a quesadilla with it for dinner. So I made a quinoa tortilla. I'm so scared to try this. I don't know what this is gonna taste like. I am gluten free and I'm also allergic to corn, so I can't eat corn tortillas, which is a really weird thing to be allergic to. Um, so I haven't found a tortilla that tastes anything like a regular one, like a flour tortilla. I have yet to find one that tastes good. So I got this at Trader Joe's. It's a quinoa tortilla. I'm nervous to try it, but it kind of smells normal. Oh my gosh. This tastes like a normal tortilla. I'm so surprised. I have a class at six and I don't really have time to meal prep. Um, Normally I meal prep on Mondays, but I was way too busy yesterday. I didn't have groceries, so I didn't make chicken. Like I just meal prep chicken, um, but like I do a lot of it at once and it takes a long time to make because our stove likes to set off the fire alarm like every time we use it. I did not think this would be so good. So I'm just gonna eat kind of like a small dinner, I guess, because class at six and I'll just eat again whenever I get back. I just got out of my last class for the day. I'm also seeing what this camera looks like at night. And honestly, the quality is so good. Like it is actually really dark in my car right now, I feel like. So it's almost 10.30. Sometimes I just have these nights where I'm so bored and like I'm so bored of just sitting in my bed doing nothing because I don't have anything to do. And I just like can't look at my computer anymore. Oh my gosh, is this not gonna come off? So, our sink is full of dishes and I'm the only one here. So, if I don't clean it, then nobody will. So, I'm gonna load the dishwasher and clean our kitchen a little. I know, like, nobody wants to see this because it's nasty, but this is our sink right now.
I don't know if it's weird to do this, but I think I might let this sit overnight. Like, I just filled them up and plugged the drain with really hot water and soap. And I feel like I just need to let them stay like this overnight. Plus, I don't want to stick my hand in it right now to unplug it because it is burning hot. So it is almost one and I'm gonna go to bed because I have some stuff to do tomorrow morning. But I'm just so happy I don't have class because normally I would have to wake up at eight o'clock and I actually get to sleep in. So I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. Today is Wednesday. It's 10 o'clock right now, which today I was supposed to sleep in, okay? And I woke up before eight and I just laid in bed and I could not fall back asleep. I don't know why. I have a whole checklist of things that I need to get done today. Also, I'm breaking out so bad and I don't know if it has to do with wearing a mask or just like, I don't know. It's just all of a sudden really bad and I hate when that happens. So we're pulling into Duncan. It's so rare that there's never a line, but there's no line today. Hey, could I get a medium iced coffee with um, cream and sugar? Cream and sugar? Yes. Anything else, ma'am? That's all. I got embarrassed because there was somebody behind me. Have a good day, honey. Thank you, Bye. you too. That was like the fastest I've ever gone to Dunkin'. I'm trying this before I leave because I'm nervous because I haven't gotten this coffee since Honestly, since I think I was like in high school or like the very beginning of college, um, cause I started, I stopped drinking coffee and then now I get ice caramel macchiatos from here, but. It's good, but I feel like it doesn't have that much flavor. Like, it's basically a just regular iced coffee with cream and sugar in it and like it needs the sugar to me like people get it with just cream and that i feel like that would taste like nothing because sometimes they make it like too creamy and not enough coffee but it's pretty good i'm happy with it i wanted to try something new because i just like wasn't in the mood for something super sweet like the ice caramel macchiato is really sweet so i wasn't feeling it today i feel like an actual vlogger with this angle <laughs> that the air isn't like loud. I got my package from Amazon. I'm back in the car because I'm actually gonna go home right now just for a few hours because I want to bring a bike back because I want to bike to school or at least try to bike to school and like I don't wanna pay for a whole new bike because they're expensive. But I did get my Amazon package that I was waiting for. This is a spider tripod which is um, basically just like, just really easy to like attach to anything. And then I got uh, the mount for my car. So I might as well put that on right now. Try it out, is this like tiny little thing? So I went to go stick this on and it only sticks to like glass or a window, like that material. So I'm, I'm mad because I, w I wanted it to be able to go on my dash. I basically just suctioned it to my main screen on my, like dash. Oh my gosh. There is just a <gasps> There's a fridge in the middle of the highway. Should I call 911? I don't know if anyone's reported that yet. Like, I don't know if this just happened. There is a full fridge. Like a massive white fridge just sitting in the middle lane of the highway and there's like glass shards everywhere thank god i'm like sitting here alone because imagine if i was like didn't see that from far away i thought it was a box at first like a cardboard box i don't know if 
I, I'm too scared. I don't know if I should call 911. I guess I do. I feel like I should. sitting in the middle of the highway and I'm not sure if anyone reported it yet. Yep, we're on our way, ma'am. Thanks okay. for calling in. You're welcome. Thank you. Bye. Thanks. Bye. Oh my god. <laughs> Why am I shaking? Um, anyways. I'm gonna go ahead and end this here. So, thanks for watching.